totally friends with Gino Rada. I can totally introduce you to him. It's no problem. Let me just say this. You look unbelievable tonight. Maybe wear a miniskirt next time. Maybe don't wear a bra. Oh, hello. <laughs> Didn't even see you there. I'm Jay Onright. Nice to see you folks. Hope you're having a great time. Uh, Jeremy Roenick will be with you in just a moment. Uh, I've hosted events with Jeremy before. He's such a great guy. You're going to have a great time tonight. In fact, I know for sure that Jeremy's going to take everybody out on the town tonight. And so to prepare you for that, as someone who lived in Saskatoon for a year and loved it so much, uh, I'm going to set up uh, what is a classic Saskatoon night out. Uh, these are the places you need to hit uh, when you're in the 306 area code in Saskatoon. And you're going to start your night at the Sutherland. There's no question about that, right? Am I right, everybody? You start at the Sutherland. Uh, there's probably two or three beers on tap. Uh, you ease your way into the night, then you drive up to Broadway and you grab a burrito at Amigos. What a great place that is. Uh, you have some Mexican food. I know what you're thinking, fellas. Should I have Mexican food? I might have sex later. I wouldn't worry about it. I've seen all of you and I don't think that's going to be a problem. After that, you head to the Hose and Hydrant, a fun dance club. Uh, I once saw a guy trip on the stairs there and nearly kill himself. Uh, it was a hilarious proposition. After that, uh, you're going to go to Lydia's, one of the great live music venues in Saskatoon. I'm pretty sure Wide Mouth Mason is playing tonight. I'm pretty sure they've been playing there since 1976. Then you head straight up Broadway to the Yard and Flagon. Ewan Curry, the lead singer of the Sheepdogs, served me a beer there last year. And ever since he's been on the cover of the Rolling Stone, he seems to have lost my number. Speaking of stairs, the steepest stairs on the planet at the Yard and Flag. And watch yourself, gentlemen. Then you head downtown to Winston's and you have a pint. What can I say about Winston's? It's really dark. I don't know. There's not much to say about Winston's. But then you head to the most famous bar in Saskatoon, the Patricia Hotel, a.k.a. The Pat, which is like Chuck E. Cheese on steroids. It is so bright in there. Bring your shades. Finally, you finish the night off where it began, at the Sutherland. Though by this time of night, the Sutherland becomes something entirely different. It becomes the Scuzz. That's right. You're at the Scuzz now. And watch out, fellas, because the ladies are a little older at this point of the night, and they'll get you. Uh, enjoy that, everybody, later tonight. And right now, for your viewing pleasure, uh, your host, Jeremy Roenick, we have the top ten moments of JR Superstar himself, Jeremy Roenick. I'll quote a famous line from one of the popular movie Stripes. Any of you guys call me Francis? And I'll kill you. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe we have to cancel the game. Everybody, all our team, it's going to be scared. Come on. Lighten up, Francis. <laughs> you become an actor, I think. <laughs> Hi. I need to get on the next flight to Ireland. Ireland, huh? Yes. You have to check to New York. It'll just be a minute. Just take a walk. No, I used to work with ham radios when I was a kid. Uh -huh. This is a cameo, you know, just a little, you know, guest spot. Where's Mike? Oh, he just ran out of here. Well, you say where? Nope. He was definitely upset, though. No, that, that's not how I drew it up. But I scored a real beauty the next night, which, in my mind, I flop over. Sweet, my God, 22 years old. You're not supposed to pull moves like that at 22. Can't stop a three, kid. Huh? Can't stop a three. <laughs> no way, kid. Come here, give me a little bit of that. Gina. Gina, you're hot. Well, good thing you're going to get that truck. The bad thing is you're going to be smiling all day on TV. I don't think that's that pretty. He says he doesn't see it. I mean, what the, what the hell is he looking at? You know, they have to take responsibility for the way that they referee. You know, National Hockey League has to step in and tell these guys to open up their eyes. I mean, it's ridiculous. What the 
already. It's a joke. Wake up. <coughs> NHL, wake up. Reunited and it feels so good. Ooh, you can dance. I'm all out of love. I can be your hero, baby. You hear that? How sexy is that? But I can kiss away the pain. <laughs> Embarrassing. <laughs> It's not even so much me as it's Ronick. He's good. Oh, is that right? Charlie steals to Ronick. Score, Chicago! Oh, oh man. my... Oh! That was pretty. Stop. That was pretty, Sue. Check this out on the instant replay. Dude, do not... You said it was... Check it out. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Yeah. This is great shot. If you weren't playing great this show, look at it. Come on, look at it. Come on, I Come on. I want to see, see the instant replay in the game. The Kings suck. You should play with a different team. I took the Kings to the cup. Against the computer with the offsides. They're off. a finesse team, bro. They're a team. Oh, oh, oh it's Gore Chicago! Oh, <laughs> man, you're cheating with the Blackhawks, man. Ronick, he's too good. He's the best. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just play the game. You know, he's handsome and a humanitarian, but still, man, that's bull. Oh, really? It's bull? Yeah. Why don't we just look at the instant replay then? Huh? Dude, do not. Let's just look at the instant replay. You said it was bull. Dude, we don't want to see it. Well, why do they have the instant replay in the game, huh? So you can see if it's bull. That's why they have it. That's why they have it. Excuse me, man, so much stuff going on in that shift. Look out here, two on one, Ronick and Monty Ronick, shoot, he scores! Jeremy Ronick has propelled the Flyers to the Easter Conference Finals! He filled the top shelf, that was a goal scorer goal. I should have been a penalty shot, there's no doubt about it. Um, I like Patrick's quote that he would have stopped me. I just want to know, just want to know where he was in game three. <laughs> Probably getting his jock out of the stands on the, out of the Raptors United Center, maybe. I can't really hear what Jeremy says because I got my two Stanley Cup rings plugged in my ear. Well, thank you very much, Chris. Oh, great work. Well, we have the best staff here. I said cucumber water! Oh, sorry. People just don't understand what I need to do this job. Uh, folks, I hope you enjoyed the top ten. I hope you have a great night tonight in Saskatoon. I wish I could be with you. And ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce your, your guest speaker, your guest of honor for the evening. Number 27 in your program, number one in your heart, JR Superstar, Jeremy Roenick.